I do wonder if these rapidly rising yields, still low historically, I admit, but yep. rapidly rising yields might sort of be, you know, the arrow uh, that shoots at the heart of the market. What do you think? It, it could be. I mean, you know, if we're going to have a, a free fall in the market, it, it's more likely to be something like 1987, where there was no recession. Uh, but uh, the market, uh, even back then in 87, rallied partly because at the end of 86, there was tax reform, wouldn't you know it? Uh, and it wasn't until October that the market really took a dive for all sorts of reasons. But one of them was bond yields, in fact, went up quite a bit. Uh, they went up by like 300 basis points back then. Here, uh, there's talk that if we just go over 3% on the 10-year, that that might unnerve the market. I don't think so. I think uh, seeing the bond yield go up here would just confirm that the economy is doing well, that we're finally seeing self-sustaining growth at the Fed can raise interest rates some more, and that's actually a healthy thing. Is tax reform going to give us another leg higher? Would that be would that be sort of the, the cherry on top, if you will, Ed? Well, the, the tax reform is just having an extraordinary impact on uh, on earnings. Uh, analysts, since uh, the tax package was uh, enacted, have raised their earnings by seven dollars a share for this year. That's that's a big increase. Uh, that's from what might have been 146 this year. Now they're looking for uh, $7 more than that. So that's just the the initial re the reaction. We'll see what, what else is to come. And by the way, that's not the only positive. The other positive is all this repatriated money that's coming back. Uh, we've been reading the um, some of these uh, conference calls the companies have had, and it almost feels like they want to pinch themselves. They can't believe you know, how great this is for their business. And they're just trying to figure out all the ways they can spend it. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.